Happy Monday, you guys. Happy Monday. Well, the sun isn't out yet. I'm hoping it comes out, but if it doesn't, we're still going to make the best of it. So let's get going. Good morning. Welcome back to the vlog. Um, so it is a Monday and it is a manic Monday. Um, I've been in my emails and things are kind of just going crazy at work, but it is what it is. So, um, you saw we have a little bit of gray. We've been having really pretty nice weather and, um, I'll show you. I actually got out this past weekend and in nature and went for a walk. It was beautiful. It was just amazing. So hopefully more good weather to come and getting out in nature, it really makes me feel so much better. Um, as you guys know, I have been struggling a little bit mentally. Um, so yeah. Hopefully more sun and that always help and me sticking to the gym. Oh yeah, we didn't go to the gym early this morning, but we're going to try to hit it a little later today because like I said, things are just really busy. I do have my first meal. Let me tell you, overnight oats. Okay, not oats, fine. Um, Faux oats. What I did, I found that makes it so much creamier when you're mixing all your ingredients together. So the hemp hearts... The flax meal, I did um, chia seeds, protein powder. Mix them all together in a blender, then throw them in your cup or a little container and seal it and put it in your refrigerator overnight in the morning. All you have to do is add a little water or a little heavy cream, a little nut milk, and it's good to go. So that is what I did. Let me grab my stuff. Here it is. It don't look appetizing. I did cut up um, two little turkey sausage links into mine, but it's good. It's really good. I added a lot of cinnamon. So that's going to be meal number one. Um, I need to get my water going too so I can get all my water in. Um, honestly, I'm not feeling all that great. It's not, it's more mental. It's just all more mental, but. I'm going to push through, and I do have an appointment with a therapist coming up, so yay for that. But just a reminder, there is no shame in going through down times of bouts of depression, anxiety, and, you know, a host of other things, because it happens. We're living in a very chaotic and crazy world. And just trying to manage and stay on top of things can be a lot sometimes. And I know it's called adulting, but sometimes it can be hard and challenging. So just always check in with your mental health and make sure you're doing everything within your power to just stay balanced. You know, whatever that balance might look like, it might look like you need to do meditation, have a counselor, go on walks, talk to friends. Whatever you can do to help mitigate some of that, please do it. So with that being said, let me eat my first meal. I need to get back to work. We're going to work in getting to the gym because that's a must. And um, I'll check in a little later. Okay, we are at the gym, getting ready to get our workout in so we can get back home. All right, guys, so we got through our workout. It was a good workout. I went up on weights. Um, today was leg day, so it felt really good, even though it was a little bit painful, but a good workout. And I never thought I would be one of those people that would be like, I have to have the gym. And that's where I'm at. The gym, to me, helps so much with my mentals. Um, just... It's keeping me sane to a degree. I know that's a weird thing to say and it's a weird way to put it. Um, sometimes when you get into situations where it's a catch-22. So I will say my, my job. I love 
my job, but it's giving me hell right now. I'm living where I'm living in the state of Washington. It's really rough for me. It has been for the last probably four or five years. But the catch is that my job is good and, you know, the benefits are great. And I have applied to other places, especially like in California, um, where there's more sun and it's not so dreary and cold and gray. You know, because it's really hard on me mentally when there's, you can bank on there being sun maybe two months out of the year. And the rest of the days are okay, some mostly cloudy, some mostly kind of like dreary and all that. That really wreaks havoc on my mental health. So the gym always makes me feel better. I go there, I do my workout, and... All of a sudden, I just feel the endorphins. So if you're going through something and it's really hard and I'm just going to say you're kind of stuck. You weigh options and it's like, okay, you got to push through this. Find something or anything that can give you joy to help you get through that rough patch. You know, so let me get back to work and I will check in a little bit later. All right, I am sitting down with my next meal. Let me see if I can get this angle correct. Oh man, yes, some ground beef, a little bit of broccoli. Let's see, that's really good, and some cauliflower rice. So I'm going to eat this. It's a busy day for me, and I need to get back to work. All right, guys, I am back, and we're going to do our final meal for today. Today was um, a pretty good day. It was busy, but it was a pretty good day. Um, the sun never came out. We had a little bit of drizzle, a little bit of you know rain and drizzle, gray, cool. But we made the best of it. We got our workout in. We did all the responsible things. So final meal, cauliflower um, mash with, I don't know if you can see this. I have a cut up chicken thigh at the bottom of it and that's gonna be my final meal and I got most of my water in I still have about maybe a good four ounces to go so that will give me 100 ounces of water so I'm gonna do that and um, I'm going to get off of here and we'll pick this up again tomorrow so I will see you guys in the morning Mwah. Okay, we're at the gym, and it is cardio day, so let's get it going because it's raining outside, or other than that, I'll be out there walking. Let's go. Alrighty, good morning. Another day. It is Tuesday. We were at the gym. We did good at the gym. So we're now back home, and I'm realizing I'm running out of meat. So I stopped and picked up some meat from the store. We have some ground beef. We have a ribeye, and we have some chicken thighs I took out of the freezer. I'm going to cook all that stuff up. I'm not going to show you what I'm doing, how I'm doing it. You guys already know how to cook burgers and all that stuff, but I'll just show you the finished product, and we'll go right into the first meal. So let me get going with this, and I will check in a little bit later. Okay, so... I've cooked up the steak and some burgers. Look how nice that steak is looking. And here are the burgers. And the chicken is still defrosting, so I'll get that cooked up a little later. And for breakfast, we have steak and eggs. Some leftover steak, with a little bit of leftover ground beef, and two scrambled eggs. And I'm going to call this good for right now. I need to get back to work. And I will be checking in with you guys a little bit later. I hope your day is going fantastic so far. Okay, I am back. I finally got the chicken in the oven cooking. And I'm looking at the time. It's like, it's already 2 o'clock. And it's like, I really want to eat something. So, um, 
I'm going to have this burger. You know, so I made the hamburgers earlier. So I'm just going to have a burger and have sugar-free ketchup on it. And get back to work. And I will check in a little bit later. Okay, everyone. I am back. And the chicken thighs are ready. It smells so good. And I did have a little taste of a little tiny piece. So good. So delicious. So... Now, we're fully set with some meat, kind of, sort of. You don't have to worry about it for the next couple of days. And I need to get this put away, but I'll be back for my final meal. Good morning. Happy Wednesday. Welcome back to the vlog. So yesterday, I'm trying to remember, the last thing you saw maybe was me doing baking the chicken. Well, I baked it and I showed it to you. And I apologize after that. I got so freaking busy. And then when work was over, I said, okay, I'm taking a nap. Then, of course, a nap turned into a little bit longer than I wanted. Um, so the only thing you missed, actually, was um, I got up. Um, I had, I'm like, I'm looking at the time. It was like 7.50 or something. And I'm like, yeah, I'm not going to eat too much. So I just had um, one chicken thigh. And I drank some water and I called it good. So here we are today. It is 5.20 a.m. And here in the cubicle. Um, so I do have some um, Gatorade Zero. Um, what else I have with me? cauliflower rice with broccoli in here with a lot of turmeric you know I lay with my turmeric turmeric on everything almost um right in here I have my meats I have chicken thigh and I have a piece of ribeye so that's what I have with me for today um I do have some creamer for my coffee and yeah I'm showing you, of course, you know, I'm showing you all of this now. Um, more than likely, I will not be able to show it when I actually eat it because it's loud. It gets crazy. Um, and the next time I check in, we'll probably be back at home. Um, I'm going to get work started. I need to get a walk in. Um, so... In between everything, I'm trying to get in a total of 45 minutes of my walking for today. So, yeah. Again, I'll check in probably when I get back home. So, I hope your morning is going well. And I hope you guys don't even have to get up quite this early. So, see you a little bit later. Alrighty, I am back. We are home. It's been a chaotic, crazy day. And, uh... I'm just glad it's over. So it is 5.40 and we are eating our final meal. So from this morning, I did have some of my vegetables left over, just a tiny, tiny bit. And I'm going to have a burger. So this is what how I'm gonna end my day. I got my water in and I think before I go to bed, I'm gonna try to get two more ounces in. Um, so food wise, on point, um, everything else wise, not really. <laughs> so, but thank you guys. Thank you so much for following me on my journey, whether the ups, the downs, the sideways, the, the craziness. So I really, really appreciate it. I know it's boring as hell, um, cause I'm a creature of habit and I just tend to eat the same things. And like I said before, I haven't been getting out like I did in the past. There were times where I, we were always on the go filming something and having fun. And I need to get back to that. I really do. So I thank you so much for all of your support over the years, the months, the days, whatever. And I will be back for another video. Mwah!